the state of, of arts funding here in Manitoba, I, in Canada, I, I really get upset when I think about what's happening. Uh, recently, uh, our federal government has introduced a bill Sorry. Uh, which, which is aimed directly at the Canadian Flammable Children's Pajamas Manufacturers Association. Uh, basically what the bill entails is, is that it will prevent groups who fund the arts, such as the, 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 the pajama manufacturers, from using, well, from, from advertising, and this will in effect cut off money to the arts community. Not only will this bill uh, essentially destroy the artistic community, but the number of jobs lost directly by the loss of advertising through the print media and, and whatever other media are employed is, is staggering. Uh, approximately 2,500 jobs will be lost directly as a result of this ban on advertising. And countless other jobs will, will be lost indirectly. Uh, approximately 35,000 children a year are seriously burned in pajama fires. And the firemen, the morticians, the doctors, the hospitals, they, they'll all lose this, this valuable income generating activity. And who I'm, does it hurt anyway? I mean, we've got some politicians, they, it, it's topical. I mean, uh, flaming pajamas, I mean, that's what gets votes. You don't allow flaming pajamas. Well, fine, I happen to have bought flaming pajamas for my niece and nephew and, and they were only mildly burned and I feel, I feel happy that I was allowed the privilege to buy this because I saw the ad. I mean, I, I might not have bought it if I hadn't seen the ad, but I, I might have bought it anyway. Well, one, one interesting sidelight to this entire controversy is th those in the manufacturing association have found that indeed the more they advertise, the, the, the less people go out and buy flaming children's pajamas. And it seems to me that this is counterproductive if they want to save the, these supposed children. Uh, a complete ban on advertising will not do this. They, the exact opposite. They should force them to advertise more. And in fact, I've seen some statistics. Uh, in, in Sweden, they actually did ban the advertising of the, of the flaming pajamas. And in fact, sales went up when they stopped it. They, there was so much publicity uh, by the media against the, the government for when they, they did put the ban on the advertising of these pajamas that sales just skyrocketed. You know, I, I, I think that the, the next step in this, this, this government uh, ploy or whatever it is will be to maybe make children wear, I don't know, asbestos pajamas or something. Uh, here, once again, the asbestos manufacturers will advertise and support the arts community, and then we'll find out that, well, these pajamas are carcinogenic or something. 